y'all, I've got to tell y'all a story about what just happened. Oh my. <laughs> I have a little nephew, okay? And this little son bitch, me and him are tighter than peas and carrots. We really are. But he gets me in more shit than any other person in this whole world. He calls me up yesterday. He says, Uncle Zach, you want to run me to school in the morning? I want to ride in a big truck. I said, yeah, man, I'll run you to school. So I run over, pick him up yesterday. He stays the night with me last night. We're sitting in the living room, okay? The man, he, he says, Uncle Zach. He said, Uncle Zach, I gotta ask you something. I said, what you got, buddy? He said, I'm having woman problems. I said, you don't know the half of it, buddy. <laughs> he said, no, I'm serious. I need help. I said, all right, man, I'm gonna help you out. What, what's your, what kind of woman problems can you possibly have at 10 years old? He said, well, I'm having a little bit of trouble getting this girl's attention. I, I like, like, she looks at me sometimes and she talks to me, but she don't want to just stay there and just talk to me. She always wants to talk to everybody. I said, all right, I know the type. That's okay. That, that, that tends to happen throughout life, buddy. He said, well, how do I get her attention? I said, man, look, women, no matter the age of them, they respond to confidence. All right. You got to be confident. You got to walk straight up to her, look at her dead in the eye and say, do you want to be my girlfriend? And if she does, hug her, or, or you know, if you want to go for the gusto, just give her a kiss right there on the lips. Believe me, your daddy will understand if you get in trouble for her. Just give her a kiss right there on the lips. Well, we wake up this morning, take his ass to school, and he asked me about it. He said, you really think I ought to do that? I said, I'm telling you, man, if you want to get this girl's attention, you got to walk straight up to her before class even starts. You walk straight up to her, do it in front of everybody. That way she knows that you're serious. He goes, okay, Uncle Zach, I'm going to do it. I said, sounds great, buddy. I'll holler at you after school and we'll see how it went. I wasn't gone from car riders for more than like 30 minutes and I get a phone call. <laughs> and it's his daddy who has now been notified that my little nephew walked into class. This little, hold on. This little son bitch walked in class, threw his damn book bag down, walked straight over to this girl said, I gotta talk to you. She came over to him and he didn't say a damn word. He just kissed her right on the lips. The only fucking problem was, it was the fucking teacher. <laughs> this little motherfucker walked in class, walked straight up to his teacher. Say, come here, I gotta talk to you. She bent down and he kissed her right on the fucking lips. I can't. <laughs> oh, he didn't. He didn't get in trouble for it, but he's dead. Damn sure got a phone call. Me and this motherfucker been on the phone for the last ten minutes laughing. I ain't never laughed so hard in my life. Little man likes older women. <laughs> Shit! Oh, I gotta talk to him when he gets out of school. I should have specified that you probably need to go for somebody in your age group. That's my bad. I get it. <laughs>